Hi guys, so today we are going to start a new mini vlog series. We're gonna go around to the different DVC resorts and we're gonna check them out because they are doing special room tours here. Some of the rooms you don't really get a chance to see that often. So we're gonna go check it out and our first stop here, we're at the Polynesian. So before we go on the tour, I decided to stop in at Kona, who has some of the best wings I've ever had. They are doing the QR code for the menu. And with lunch comes the pineapple rolls with butter. These are some of my favorite rolls on property too. I really love it here at Kona. And then as a drink, I got the tropical macaw. It is like a fruity kind of drink. I think it's pineapple juice, has some grenadine in it. Not quite sure what else, but I'll let you know pretty good so here are the wings it looks like there's less sauce on than usual and more macadamia nut and the color is a little off on the camera but they are like a golden orangish color and I got a side of french fries all right sauce update I was able to get some extra sauce for the wings which is really exciting because let's be honest I could drink that sauce well, I just finished at Kona. It was pretty good. Um, not as good as it usually is, but I did really enjoy it. Service was awesome, so thank you, Sarah. And in case you didn't notice, I did change my mask. Um, I do change it about every two hours or after I eat because uh, fresh mask is a good mask. So let's go on that DPC tour now. There she is, straight across the Seven Seas Lagoon, Cinderella Castle. And then here are all the bungalows, but you gotta keep going. They're doing a tour of the very last one. So right when you walk in, there's a bedroom to the left, um, sleeps three, beds elevated so you can put suitcases and stuff underneath, and there's the pullout with Lilo and Stitch. And there's a great view out this window of the beach and the Polynesian, lots of storage, really pretty. Right then to the right is the master bedroom. It sleeps too. There's a king bed. Big TV. Over here is the storage area. Bed is elevated just like in the other room to fit the suitcases underneath. And there is a private entryway into uh, the lanai, which is the outdoor patio. And if you look out this window, you can see the ferry boats coming and going, taking people to and from Magic Kingdom. And then if you go out this way, you have the bathroom. There is a TV in the mirror. Hi. Bathtub, shower, and I believe there's a toilet with mermaids. And then there's another split bathroom in here. Pretty standard bathroom. I love the decorations in here though. Lots of storage over here. And then over here is the full washer and dryer. Okay, so here is the full kitchen. Uh, fridge, dishwasher, oven, microwave. Entryway to the patio. And then this room sleeps three. There's a queen sleeper sofa. And probably my favorite little detail is the water pageant on the pull-out bed. And then when you come outside, there's this nice patio area. They call it a lanai. 
there's a little pool down here you can sit in it watch the fireworks there is they do have speakers so when the fireworks are running you can actually hear the music in time with the fireworks another awesome view at least in this cabin which is the one all the way down by the ttc of the ferry boats you can see the monorail going and there's these really awesome chairs here i'm not going to sit in them because of everything going on but they look super comfortable that's the entryway into the master bedroom and there go the monorails we missed the ferry boat it's way out there but you can see space mountain you can see cinderella castle so far this is off to a really good start seeing everything and there are balcony rules basically don't be dumb um don't feed anything don't throw anything over the balcony do not lean over the railing um, because there are alligators and snakes in the area so be careful guys that'll do it for me from here at the polynesian that was an awesome room it was a great way to start everything went to kona had some food they do serve dole whips here but i didn't get one because i don't really like dole whips that much blasphemy i know don't know where we're gonna go next but i know it's gonna be awesome so as usual, thank you so much for following along with me, and always remember to soar over the magic. See you guys!